So Crossan picks up 18 on the play. Crossan uh, looking for his first 100-yard game of his career. This is Crossan again, breaks the first tackle, and he's off to the races, and he is inside the five. He's in for the touchdown. Again, when you have a quarterback with this kind of running ability, the empty backfield doesn't mean a whole lot because he can run the ball as well. Reeves fires, and this one's caught for the touchdown. Yeah, that's interesting. Both quarterbacks, huh? Le a southpaws here. You don't see that too often, do you? Love to see it, though. <laughs> the Kenny Stabler, uh, Jim Zorn thing going on. Any other southpaws you can think of? Well, you, you and I go back. <laughs> a lot of people won't remember those guys. This one's going to be picked off. That's the first INT. Lamar Edmonds, the senior from Worcester, Mass. They lost three defensive ends from last year's team. All were fifth-year seniors. So not only wideouts, uh, but on the defensive front. And this one's blocked. Blocked by the Wildcats. And they're going to take it over inside the 10-yard line. Already sitting on a 20 to nothing lead. Crossan waits for his blocks. Crossan in for another touchdown, his third of the afternoon. I stand corrected. Of course, that play was rerun, re so it's only third down. Good pop at the goal line, but Crossan falls over for another touchdown. That's his fourth. New Hampshire, early in the season, they're giving up 447 yards a game. That's last in the CAA, but those numbers can be skewed, of course, going back to that San Jose State game. And Thompson does a nice job avoiding the rush, and he fires a rocket and a strike for the touchdown pass in the end zone. Thompson releases the ball, and it falls incomplete. It's going to be picked off. Thompson fires. This one's going to be picked off. Four INTs now. So Adam Reese goes the distance uh, here for uh, Sean McDonald. Did not see Trevor Knight. Sean Goldrich still waiting to get healthy, to take over the reins again. Did not see Chris McCormick. And so they did not use the two-quarterback uh, platoon system. That's going to be the final play. The final 22 seconds will run off. Another victory for Coach Mack in his 17th season.